Hi gorgeous souls and welcome to our Soulette conversation number 27. Today it's all about relationships. This one is gonna be a really quick, quick video, quick live stream. Um, you can see me in all my website building glory uh, with um, <laughs> wild hair, don't care. <laughs> because I have spent all day today building on the new website. I have made great progress. Um, I haven't made great progress in the morning when I was super tired and I resisted sleeping. And I was like, Dennis was out for two hours. And then he came back and I'm like, I just uploaded five pictures. I haven't done more in those two hours. And he was like, you need sleep. You need food and sleep and then you can work on it. So I spent the entire afternoon working on my website getting it up, getting it ready to get it out, go up. And um, yeah, so that is my website building hair, isn't it fine? <laughs> and I'm hopping on today to share a concept, an idea that when I first learned about it back in uh, 2015, I think, um, back when I learned about it um, in depth, uh, it it shook my world, it shook my understanding of relationships, it shook everything I thought I knew about how relationships should, or relationships work. This is not only about external relationships, so not only about the relationship to your parents, your siblings, your partner, um, your children, um, any other people in your life, it's also about the relationship to yourself. So make sure that you apply it there as much as you apply it um, on the external ones, you apply it in the internal relationship as well. The concept is out of uh, the book The Big Leap by Gay Hendricks um, and uh, that book rocked a lot of my fundamentals, a lot of my, my core beliefs. Um, and there is like this little nugget in there that stayed with me and that, that made such an impression on me. And that is that in every relationship, they're not like the responsibility for the relationship isn't 50-50. Like most people believe that the relationship or like the responsibility for a relationship, that it works perfectly, that it's good, is 50-50. This is not the case. This is not the case, not with this concept at least. And I believe in this concept deeply. It just like, it speaks on me on a truth level and I feel it right there in my chest. Um, the, the minute I read it, I was like, oh my God, this is truth. Um, so, <laughs> so that was like really present for, for me. Um, and today when I tuned into the converse, uh, conversation, into the energy of this soul-like conversation, uh, because that's, that's how I do them, right? I tune into the energy and ask like, what needs to be shared? What is important? Um, that was what came forward. Um, because I was like, I was sitting there tuning into the energy. I was like, you know what? I'm really exhausted. Like I'm fighting off this cold. Maybe you can hear it a little bit. It's sitting in my lungs. And so the website work was perfect because I didn't have to move much because every time I walk to the toilet and back, I'm going like, <gasps> um, so, and I, sh I tuned into, I was like, I really don't feel like doing my life. And they were like, okay, so do an easy one. So this is my little nugget. Oh gosh, I'm, I'm like, I'm making this longer than it needs to be, but I hope you enjoyed hearing me talk anyway. <laughs> I would love to hear from you where you're from where you're joining in um, and if you're here live if there is a life up there at your life otherwise you're on the replay um, so pop a hello in the comments and where you're um, coming from or where you're tuning in from and um, I'm coming to the core of this live video <laughs> It is getting really ridiculous at this stage. Okay, so this little nugget is out of the big leap. There are a lot of great concepts that really, really speak to my core, to my, like, yes, this is true for my soul. Um, but this little concept is just um, so divine. Because once you've got it, and I don't mean here, I don't mean in your mind, I mean in your heart. Once you feel that, once you, you 
accept it once you know it from your know it with your being there is no going back and the concept is that there is not a shared responsibility of 50 50 or 30 70 or 40 60 percent in a relationship the concept is that every person coming into a relationship relating to each other comes into the relationship with a hundred percent of their responsibility I say this again, this might sound weird if you have grown up with the concept of like shared responsibility, every relationship is a shared responsibility. You say like, I'm doing my 50%, but he's not showing up for his 50%. Um, then this might be life changing for you as well, because it was for me when I, when I first learned about it. Every person, if you have a healthy, thriving relationship, Every person coming into that relationship brings 100% responsibility for their part of the relationship. Does that make sense? Can I have some love arts <laughs> to make sure that I'm making sense? Or that, no, I know this makes sense. That is not like conscious language again, right? I'm making sense. I, I'm asking myself if I can explain it appropriately. Awesome. Yes, you're understanding me. Janice, Sarah, you're both, un I'm both understanding me. My beautiful Canadian beauties. Here we go. So when you come to a relationship, it's 100% your responsibility to show up as who you are and to make clear what is okay with you and what not. That's your boundaries. That's setting your boundaries, setting your standards. And it is also your, uh, your responsibility that is part of your 100% to communicate these boundaries. And then there is the other 100% from the other person. And no matter how much they show up, no matter how much they show up, if they show up 20%, if they show up 30%, if they show up their 50%, the only thing you have any control over is your 100%, not theirs, yours. And if you try to take on more, if you try to take on, like they're missing 20%, they're missing 40%, whatever, then you're overcompensating and you're crossing that line and you're not, you're not, like it's not a healthy relationship any longer. So there's these two sides, like either you're doing like you're pointing fingers saying like it's his fault because he's not showing up his part of the deal whatever or then you're overcompensating trying to to do more than what it, it is that you're responsible for so when two people whose needs are met or who communicate how their needs can be met by the other person come together and both show up in their 100% responsibility, then a beautiful, healthy relationship can occur. The same is, of course, true for your internal relationship. If you feel unsupported inside, make sure you support yourself. Show up for yourself 100%. Because, and here's one more thing before I hop off, your external relationships only mirror your internal relationship that's all i have to say today um i'm wrapping this up i'm going back to my website i'm really excited i hope i can either share the link with you tomorrow or on thursday depending on my lungs and my sleep levels um, <laughs> And yeah, I'm signing off. There will be offers on the website for readings, for sessions, for healings and clearings. And of course, for the retreat, which is coming up in May. So if that retreat is calling you, please uh, call me or write me, message me. Oh, the website is so beautiful, Sarah. It's like... Um, I took parts of the old website that I designed earlier this year, but I made it more like the this new level I have stepped into. I, I made it more into that too. And I, I'm just like, 
yeah there are new pictures on there and like new quotes and I, I just it's it's good I really love it so um, all is left to <laughs> make it ready to show it to you hopefully tomorrow or then on Thursday before the week is over you will see this website promised committed here it goes um, <laughs> You can see my eyes going like, oh, <laughs> no, it's fine. You will see more website hair. Here. here we go. Um, pictures for people. Mm. Then I said the same. I took a really beautiful picture. Janice just popped into the comments making pictures for people. Um, I made really beautiful pictures of Dennis showing his essence in his pictures. And it was really great. So... It has been an idea and we will play with that on, on the retreat in Ireland, definitely. So yeah, there's more coming. <laughs> um, I'm letting my artists out here as well and more channeling and all the things. So yeah, make sure you tune in for that one. <laughs> you check the website when it's up um, before the end of the week. Okay, uh, I lost my train of thoughts. Oh, I was, I was I was wrapping up anyway. Okay, you see, <laughs> this is how you when you get like two and a half hours sleep and then are awake for four hours with the baby straight because she's teething and then you're asleep for another one and a half hours and then you try to function normally. So mama realness right here. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> okay, I'm wrapping up. Show up a hundred percent for yourself in your relationships and watch how they transform if you don't try to push that responsibility away which feeds into the conversation we had yesterday about money and time it's the same with your with your relationships with other people okay i'm signing off i'm sending you so much love so much love and light you're loved you're supported you're guided you're okay all as well I love you. Take care and I'll see you tomorrow for our next Solek conversation.